The Miami Dolphins are reportedly considering signing Jason Pierre-Paul, the Super Bowl-winning defensive end from the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. This comes after their edge player Jalon Phillips suffered a brutal Achilles tear. Pierre-Paul, a 13-year NFL veteran, may not be in his prime, but he brings passion and intensity to the game. He had impressive seasons with the New York Giants, earning double-digit sacks, first-team All-Pro honors, and a Super Bowl ring with the Buccaneers in 2020. Last season, he had a solid performance with the Baltimore Ravens. While it's not official yet, Dolphins fans can anticipate a boost to their defense with Pierre Paul's potential signing. Hey Dolphins Nation, welcome back to Fins Up. News by a fan to fans. I'm here with some breaking news that's got the Miami Dolphins fan base buzzing. Our guy Ian Rappaport just dropped a bomb on Twitter, and it's all about the Dolphins making moves in the free agency market. So, here's the scoop. Almost two weeks after Jason Pierre-Paul, the Super Bowl-winning defensive end from the Tampa Bay Buccaneers, joined forces with the New Orleans Saints, it looks like he might be heading to the Sunshine State. Yep, you heard it right. JPP could be donning that teal and orange for the remainder of the season. Now, you might be wondering why the Dolphins are eyeing JPP. Well, unfortunately, our edge player Jalon Phillips took a hit with a brutal Achilles tear this past Sunday. It's tough news for sure, but the Dolphins are looking to fill that gap, and Ian Rappaport is spilling the tea that they've got their sights set on Pierre Paul. Jason Pierre-Paul, a 13-year NFL veteran, might not be in his prime days from his New York Giants era or his time in Tampa Bay, but one thing's for sure, he's bringing the heat, the passion, and the grind every single day. And you know what? That's exactly the kind of spirit we need in Miami. Taking a trip down memory lane, JPP had some killer seasons back in 2011 and 2014 with the Giants, double-digit sacks, first-team All-Pro in 2011, three-time Pro Bowl selection, and let's not forget that Super Bowl ring with the Buccaneers in 2020. The man's got a track record. This season, he made a brief appearance with the Saints, notching up two tackles in one game. But hey, let's not forget his solid performance last year with the Baltimore Ravens, starting in 13 games and racking up 26 tackles, 5 tackles for loss, 3 sacks, and even snagging an interception. So, Dolphins fans, get ready for some JPP action. It's not official yet, but it's looking like our defense might just get a boost from a veteran with a hunger for victory. Keep your eyes peeled, and as always, go Miami!